Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto. I hope you're all doing great. Hope you're having a great start of this week. And um, uh, yeah, welcome to another update on WSM. I know I said yesterday that I probably wouldn't do a daily update anymore, but yesterday the bearish breakout we talked about happened. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to do a little bit more of an overview of WSM and, and just talk about the potential that's still there, if there is any potential left in general. And, um, and just, uh, yeah, what's going on? I mean, WSM is falling quite a bit now. It's now under the listing price and under the pre-sale price after getting that bearish breakout uh, below the pre-sale price level at around 3.2, 3.4. I think the listing, listing price was, th was 3.3 cents. Uh, broke down below that, you can see it took a, a nice bearish break retest. It's respecting the technicals, which is interesting. And now it has continued falling. So I wanted to talk about two things. Um, and we'll start off with, with what's going on with WSM and does it still have potential? And um, that's a difficult question because I do still think it has potential to rally, which I do want to talk about a little bit later. But right now it does look like it's slowly dying. Uh, you can see the volume. Volume is decent, uh, but it is also decreasing over the last, uh, or, or the volume. The volume is actually pretty high right now, but that's not necessarily a good thing if the price is falling. Because that means that a lot of people are selling WSM. And obviously, I mean, when you think about it, with, with the amount of WSM that's being staked right now, um, and therefore that, that comes to the market later, um, it's just hard, all right? Because all of the WSM that's being unstaked will probably be sold pretty quickly. Um, and what you also have, and what you should know, is that uh, this only creates more WSM on the markets. Like with every, like the total supply goes up a lot with all of those rewards. So that means that that increases the selling pressure at any mo moment of time. And the only way, like, like it, there's always selling pressure. And the only time that there's real buying pressure is if there's hype or if a new product is coming, etc. So WSM is doomed to fall. That does not mean that it cannot have rallies because obviously it can. Like we also saw in the beginning, there it also had selling pressure, probably a little bit less, but it did have hype and it did have, have, have a strong market structure. Now it just doesn't anymore. So that's bad news. And um, I know I'm probably going to get a lot of hate from for this from the WSM community. But that's just um, that's just the way I see things. Like there's this, there, there's just constant selling pressure, and you need a lot of buying pressure to to hold up against that. And that's not, and that's just not there for now. Uh, now for WSM, so I think it's more likely that it will drop down to that support level around two point seventy five cents, and eventually down to two point five cents, and perhaps eventually down to two cents. That's what I expect now. Onto the now onto the more bullish news is that I do think that in the meanwhile, like I said, we have seen the WSM when there is a little bit of hype, it can rally and it can rally hard. So if we get some sort of a new product, I mean we have talked quite a bit about a casino product, for example, if something like that is being launched, then WSM actually has a lot of potential for short-term gains. I think in the end it's doomed to fall again afterwards, but you know on the short term there's potential. Uh, but right now, that's just waiting for news. Like the most likely scenario right now is that it will continue falling until new hype and new strong buying pressure comes around. So for example, if we get an announcement that WSM is launching a casino product, it's probably going to rally. And then if it breaks above 3.2 cents, I'll enter and it can rally like a lot. Like it can really, from current levels, it could rally at least by 20%, which is not that much, but it could theoretically rally by like 45 and 50%. I just don't, I just don't expect 100% rallies again. Um, but yeah, so that's a possibility. It's just like it, the, the, the situation for WSM is that it's bearish until proven otherwise. And we're waiting for that and I'll keep you updated on that. But for now, that's my analysis. Lastly, I do want to say as well that I have my own premium trading group slash signal group in which I share my own trades. You gain access to my trading guides and access to an exclusive community full of traders. Very valuable and profitable as well, which might be interesting. Uh, if you want to join that, links will be down in the description. But for now, thank you for watching. Have a great day and bye.